Hey guys. Dragon Ball Super spoilers are already out and I'm pretty sure that most of you might have read all of them. If you haven't read them, then don't worry, I'll be covering you. As I have already said that this post contains big spoilers for Dragon Ball Super episode 121 and DBS episode 122, so please read ahead at your own risk. Now that we have got it out of the way, let's begin. The main focus in the next episode would be Aniriza, who is the final card in Universe 3's deck. The transformation took place in the Dragon Ball Super episode 120. I must say that Universe 7 was really struggling to get the upper hand in the fight. But as we know Universe 3 is going to get eliminated from the Tournament of Power. As soon as Aniriza loses, Vegeta is going to fight Jiren. This thing was confirmed in the latest spoilers. There was another confirmation when the spoilers came out. There will be two major fights in Dragon Ball Super Episode 122. Frieza will be fighting against Dispo from Universe 11. Universe 11 finally makes a move to catch the fighters of Universe 7 off guard. However, the disruption does not work as Frieza steps in to stop Dispo. Frieza is particularly annoyed with Dispo as it is thwarting his plans of winning the Tournament of Power and getting the Super Dragon Balls. So Frieza jumps in and stops Dispo from causing any harm to any of the fighters from Universe 7. The second fight is going to be Jiren vs Vegeta. Earlier it was predicted that Vegeta will be knocked out very soon. However this isn't the case as Vegeta is going to go all out and the real fight is probably going to start Dragon Ball Super Episode 123. Vegeta will be using Super Saiyan Blue first, which is fairly obvious. However, as we know that it isn't enough to cause Jiren any harm. So, Vegeta will end up getting hammered. Vegeta is knee deep in trouble and he will be knocked out unless he gets a new power to match Jiren. It is the logical thing to do so that Vegeta can at least go down fighting. However, I personally would prefer that Vegeta would end the reign of Jiren. Vegeta getting thrashed every now and then isn't really good. I hope that in Super things change for the good. I mean how long do we have to wait until Vegeta finally gets his chance? That's it for now.